Hi there, I'm Nabil Murad. In this short training video I want to show you how to deal with worksheets without using the mouse. Whether I don't have a mouse, or I lost my mouse, or the mouse batteries are dead, so I would like to be able to navigate between the different worksheets, be able to insert a new worksheet, rename the new worksheet, and move the new worksheet and even change the tab color of the worksheet without using anything except my keyboard. So we know that we have a shortcut that enables me to move from one worksheet to the other. So if I hit control page down, I can move from one sheet to the other in the right direction. If I hit control page up, I can move to the left direction. I would like to insert a new worksheet so the shortcut for inserting a new worksheet, if you don't have a mouse, it's Shift F11. So when I hit Shift F11, I'm inserting a new worksheet. Now I would like to rename this new worksheet. If I had a mouse, I would right click. The equivalent of right clicking is Shift F10. But how do I select the worksheet first? If I hit the F6 key on my keyboard, I'm moving to the sheet tabs. Now if I right click, Alternatively, I hit the Shift F10. Now this is the right-click menu, as if I'm right-clicking with my mouse on the Sheet tab. I want to move up and down, so I'll be using the arrows. I want to move down to the Rename command. When I select it, when I, when I reach the Rename command, I hit the Enter key to select it. Now I can simply type. I'm going to type my name, and then I hit Enter to name this new worksheet that I just inserted. Now I want to move it to the very end. So I want first to select the worksheet. To move my selection to the worksheet, I hit the F6 key. Now I want the right-click menu to be able to move the sheet tab, so I hit Shift F10. And then I use my arrows to move down to move or copy. Then I select it by hitting Enter. And I can move up and down by using the arrows. I want to move to the very end, and here is the Move to End. And then when I reach it, I hit the Enter key to move my worksheet to the end. The final thing I would like to do is to change the tab color. So I want to select it one more time by hitting F6. And then I want to right click. So I use the shortcut Shift F10. Remember, I don't have a mouse. So I hit Shift F10 to trigger the right click menu. And now I want to select the tab color. So I use my down arrow to go to tab color and then the right arrow to show the color palette and then I can move from one color to the other by using the tab key on my keyboard until I reach a color that I like and when I reach that color let it be red I'm going to hit enter and I would have changed the tab color let's make sure that the tab color changed so I need to activate another sheet to do that I hit the F6 key and then use my left arrow and then hit enter to select a different tab and sure enough the worksheet Nabil has been changed to red color. Using shortcuts set the difference between an average user and a professional. Shortcuts save you a lot of time. Shortcuts give you access to a lot of functionality that is available nowhere in the ribbon. And above all, shortcuts did not change since the first release of Microsoft Office up to the latest release. So if you enjoyed this training video like, comment, share and subscribe and see you in our next training video.